I love people. How y'all doing at this moment time? <clears throat> Just wanted to come on and talk to y'all for a little moment. And, um, <clears throat> yeah, y'all a few things, but, uh, let's get off into uh, a prayer. Oh, my God, it's going hurt so bad. Thank you, Father God, for waking us up this morning, blessing us. Listen us to see a new day. Watch over us and guide us. God, just protect us through us throughout this day and show us the way. And I pray, Father God, that you come through me at this moment in time. In order to give the people out of the truth. And I pray, Father God, that you let the Holy Spirit come through me at this moment in time. In order to give the people out of the truth. And thank you for this is my prayer, Father God. Amen. <clears throat> now, what I want to talk to y'all about is, uh, <clears throat> how this, uh, his enemy and these witches and these uh, church leaders and officials don't want to let you heal. This is my thing. Now, after all these things people have been through and after all these things, things that happen and all this, they continue to try and do these same old tactics and these same old routines every single day. But see, I call justice and I call judgment upon what they are doing. Because it has to be. <clears throat> they just really seem don't they just really don't want to seem to stop. And the reason why is because people are moving away from them. People see what they're doing, you know? And it's, um, they just continue to try and um, hold on to people's energy. People are moving away from all these things. <clears throat> No, so you can't force no one or or, or try and um, do something that a person don't want to do. You're only going to get the rebellious action for trying to force someone to do, trying to do something that you want them to do. Have you ever worked, have you ever dealt with a teenager? That the more and more you try and force the teenager to do something, the more and more he rebels. Did you know that? That's because <clears throat> he knows you're trying to force him to do something. And he don't want to do it because you're trying to force him to do it. But <clears throat> you have to understand <clears throat> the concept. And that's what these enemies trying to do. It's trying to force people and doing this and doing that and just trying to just. But the thing is, <clears throat> they're wicked. Their actions are wicked. People know what they're trying to do. People see what they're trying to do. Why are you continually trying to do it? Is the question. Why won't you just stop? And this is the thing. They got all these little minions with them. They're the officers, all of them now. That's why I want y'all to know now. These ones go out and do all these things. They set these things up. They send them out to do wicked things. <laughs> And 
and think that the, these officers and think that they supposed to get away with it. <laughs> and then after they done the crime, they go and um, try and get them off the case. <laughs> do you not get what I'm saying here? They send them out to do it. And then they turn around and try and get them off the case. So, I'm gonna tell you something, man. A lot of people don't understand, don't even see how these things work. It's not, it's not hard to see what is going on here. It's not hard to notice that. <clears throat> and this is another thing, too. Uh, what they're doing is uh, <clears throat> they won't want you to move. But then again, they want you to move. That's... That's a mental disorder. They don't know whether they want you to move from the spot where you're at because they're trying to run you off from the spot they're at. But then again, when you run off, get away from the spot that you're at and you go somewhere else or something like that, then they don't want you to move. <laughs> so this is, this is very... Um, they're trying to make it very disturbing for you, and they're trying to keep on prosecuting and keep on doing this and keep on doing that. They ain't finna keep on doing this. And I probably said to clarify on the sound of what's I commanded. But these former presidents and these uh these wicked ones, they're gonna pay for their action. They don't think they're gonna pay for it. They gotta pay for this action. They can stop running. They can stop running. All of them, they can stop running. <laughs> They can stop running. Because it's real. People see what you're doing, man. But the thing is, you got it. They trying to stop people from healing. You can't stop a person from healing. If God has healed that person, you need to leave that person alone. <laughs> And that's what these things are all about. Also, um, <clears throat> it's because they don't want to, um, they keep trying to have control when the Lord already told them and already showed them that they, control, they can't control his people. That it's time for them to let go and stop. Are they not listening? Are they not seeing what's happening here? <laughs> they didn't, they've been doing this for a, a, a while now, though. <clears throat> it's been time for them to let, that, let this go. See, the thing is, they keep trying to create obstacles. They keep trying to create a distraction to see if they can try and keep doing it. <laughs> yeah. I know what they're doing. They keep trying to keep doing it. Trying to figure out many ways to create a distraction or create an obstacle because they see that the, this uh, this place, this thing or whatever they have going is falling. People ain't with it no more. This gang stuff and trying to do all this to keep to keep this stuff up. This stuff is finna fall. And I pray and I prophesy the cloud decree on the side of my voice. I command it in the name of Jesus Christ. And I pray and I prophesy that it crashes and falls and burns bad. 
because it don't need to be going on still after the Lord has spoken a word twice, not once, twice. So therefore the Father has to step in at times and show him, show them that he, that he means business. And then when he shows them that he means business, everybody wants to run. But then why are you running? People tired of you. The whole entire world is tired of you. Because they know for stealing and thieving and, 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 and just doing foolish acts. And don't want to stop at certain things. You just want to keep on doing it, but okay. And these are your wicked officials. These things have to stop. There's no choice. There's no other way. They got to stop. So I'm just giving y'all um, <clears throat> the things that I go through at this moment in time and just showing y'all how, um, how these officials work and how these uh, wicked leaders operate because y'all thinking that they are so Christian so this these people are emotional energy vampires they continue to try and confiscate energy They are really, um, they're really annoying. They really are. <laughs> they are really annoying. And <clears throat> I'm a little tired at this moment in time. Uh, they keep trying to get in the way of people's progress and of their lives. And, and um, trying to stop from um, moving forward, but they can't stop people from moving forward. It does not matter what you do. You got to keep moving forward. That is a must. Ain't no if and buts about it. Keep moving. <clears throat> you got other people trying to be like other people. Also, they're trying to uh, claim themselves to be uh, um, angels so they can uh, um, to try and um, ex to try to um, cloak themselves under the light. Watch for those parts. Because it's real. Now you got us real ones out here, the real ones that's doing these things. And that's actually on the ground, that's actually on foot doing these things. And they on the front lines and they doing these things. And you got the other ones out there, they, they, they portraying to be as if and of such. And it's playing these games. And I'm praying, I'm prophesying to clarify the on some of us that they be exposed all over the whole entire planet and that they man shall fall off over the whole entire planet. I command it in the name of Jesus Christ. Because see, this is the area where the light and dark is being separated. Things have to be seen for what it is. Uh, um, 
um, it has to be the separation of of um, the good and the bad, the uh, light and the dark. You know, it has to be because it can't dwell together. They cannot come into the fifth dimension. They cannot come into heaven. You know, I talk about this all the time. And they will not. For it will be things at that door that will destroy some things, you know, like physically. My father kingdoms don't play. My father kingdom don't play, you know. So you, you have to understand. This is kingdom business. And I do whatever I'm, that the father, however the father wants me to see fit on this planet. So they keep trying to do little things and trying to uh, stay in people's energy and things like this that they can't do it. The reason why, and, and, and they don't understand why every time they send a spell work and they doing these spell work, why it's not working. This is why it's not working, because it don't supposed to be working. <laughs> you understand that? It don't supposed to be working because it's my time to heal. God has spoken a word. It is my time to do, go forward. And nothing's going to stop that. Why is this not working? Because you don't supposed to be doing it after the Lord and told you to stop. And like he's serious and that he's, it's, it's things that's going to happen if you don't stop. Are you not listening? Excuse me, guys. I'm in a place and try to be, speak too loud either. Are you not listening? I want you to understand. So I just came on here and talking out for a little minute. And look, <clears throat> what's going on now? <clears throat> and I'll let y'all know about these things, though. Um, but yeah, they, these these officials and things like this is they trying to keep trying to do this prosecuting stuff with the energy and things like this here because they don't want people to heal and things like this here. But I rebuke it and I bind it up and I cast it down because we have to heal. We have to, um, these people have to leave us alone. The Lord has spoken these things and they got to leave us alone. I don't care how much they don't want to, but they got to leave us alone. They got to. All this trying to isolate people, you got to leave people alone. Now, what the same thing the Lord has started doing, them, doing it to them? The same ones that prosecute people is the same ones that's going to be prosecuted to see how it feels. See, the Lord works in different ways. Hmm. So, to understand the things that goes on, to, to, to know that... Uh, it's just time for people to, to to move on. Things getting old. This stuff is then got old, you know. And um, this is over, you know. Stop it at once. Stop. You're the only one that keeps wants to do this. Stop. Stuff is old now. Stop. People to move on. <laughs> People to really actually like to move on because they too big for it. People to actually figure out like, why am I still doing this? Why is this still going on? I'm too big for this. I'm I'm too grown for this nonsense. To be dealing with someone else's problems every single day. 
because you don't want to do something because you're not healed or you don't want to um, um, accept your punishment, your judgment, your karma for something that you did to the people for so long because you don't want to heal. You don't want to um, um, accept your time or what you did to people. So you want to push your nonsense off on everybody else, but you can't push it off on everybody else no more. Your time has come. The universe knows who you are. He knows who all of them is. She knows who all of them is. And I call judgment upon every last one of these prosecutors that keeps trying to prosecute the saints, the body of Christ, down on the fourth, fourth time, the children of God, the people of God, the people of friend, the poor people of friend, the chosen people. Uh, uh, all the uh, homeless people, um, all the family members, all the kids, or me and my kids, Father God, the earth, the people of the planet, and the universe. <laughs> because they don't spell work on the universe as well. So I pray and I promise out, Father God, and I call judgment upon all these prosecutors and every last one of them for doing these certain things that they don't want to stop doing. I call judgment and the sentencing of these demons and these uh, extraterrestrials and these um, entities and things that, that are spiritual, non-spiritual, naturally and supernaturally. And I pray and I prophesy, I declare the decree on the sound of my voice, I command it. And that is an order, and I command it in the name of Jesus Christ. So I pray y'all take the message to the Lord Jesus Christ. Then I'm trying to get to some fast, some prayers, some reading your word. Be in relationship with the Lord, commune with the Lord. Now, this is God's good news for you today. Y'all be blessed. Amen. <laughs>